Hi, and welcome to Aviation and Air Traffic Control Keep Educating Yourself series. We'll be discussing today introduction to ICAO and PENSOPS. History. The government of United States conducted discussion with other allied nations from mid-1943. On the basis of the talks, invitations were sent to 55 allied and neutral states to meet in Chicago from 1st November 1944. For seven weeks, the delegates of 52 nations considered the problems of international civil aviation. The most important result of the conference was drawing up of a convention on international civil aviation, the charter of a new body established to guide and develop international civil aviation. It was provided that 30 days after the government of 26 nations ratified the convention, the new organization to be known as International Civil Aviation Organization, ICAO, would come into existence. Anticipating that a considerable time was certain to elapse before 26 governments ratified the convention, the conference provided for a provisional body to function in the interim period. As per Interim Agreement on International Civil Aviation, Article 1, Section 1. This was the provisional ICAO, which began to function in August 1945. PICAO was to remain in existence until the permanent organization was created. Standard letter forwarded to all PICAO staff members regarding the appointment in the Secretariat for the transition from PICAO to ICAO. Permanent International Civil Aviation Organization was set up with objectives to secure international cooperation and highest possible degree of uniformity in regulations and standards procedures and organization regarding civil aviation matters. Headquarter in Montreal, Canada, and there are seven regional offices, Bangkok, Cairo, Dhaka, Lima, Mexico, Nairobi, and Paris. ICAO assembly states are 190, and ICAO council has 36 states members. ICAO came into force on 4th April, 1947. The Chicago Convention superseded the Havana Convention signed on 28 February 1928. The first 26 states to ratify the Convention on International Civil Aviation were Argentina, Australia, Brazil, India, Ireland, Mexico, Peru, Philippines, United States, United Kingdom, and so on. Organization structure of ICAO. The three main organs of ICAO are Assembly, Council, and the Secretariat. Assembly. The all member assembly meets every three years. Every member state has one vote in the assembly, and decisions are made by a simple majority vote unless otherwise specified by the Chicago Convention. The council is a permanent body composed of 33 member states elected by assembly for three years term. Secretariat, the ICAO secretariat is headed by a secretary general who is appointed by council. The secretary general appoints the staff of the ICAO secretariat and supervises and directs its activity. This is organization structure of ICAO, consists of General Assembly, Council, Secretariat, and Regional Offices. Strategic Objectives of ICAO. ICAO works to achieve its vision of safe, secure, and sustainable development of civil aviation through cooperation amongst its member states. To implement this vision, the organization has established following strategic objectives for the current period. Safety, 
to enhance global civil aviation safety security enhance global civil aviation security environment protection and sustainable development of air transport minimize the adverse effect of global civil aviation on the environment icao members commitments by joining icao by accepting the chicago convention states undertake to collaborate in securing the highest practicable degree of uniformity in regulations standards procedures and organization in all matters in which such uniformity will facilitate and improve a navigation a navigation bureau the a navigation bureau develops technical studies for the a navigation commission and recommendations for standards and recommended practices sharps relating to the safety regularity and efficiency of international a navigation for the council 16 out of 18 annexes to the convention are of technical nature and therefore fall within the responsibility of a navigation bureau council appoints 15 members from among the nominations by the states for a term of 3 years technical secretary assist a navigation bureau the a navigation bureau plans prepares convenes and conducts regional a navigation meetings in cooperation with the regional offices and planning and global coordination officer the bureau provides general direction to regional offices on issue relating to a navigation plans annexes and pans procedures for a navigation services a navigation commission is the principal body that develops standards and recommended procedures and pans it is responsible for examination coordination and planning of icao's technical work program in a navigation field assisted by various panels nominated by contracting states and international organizations members to these panels act as subject matter expert sme standards and recommended practices changes must be approved by a navigation commission consultation with contracting states and international organizations finalized by anc submitted to the council required two third majority for adoption standards and recommended practices become applicable on specified date considered binding on the contracting states and five differences in case of unable to comply procedures for a navigation services pans do not have same status as shops developed under authority of anc in consultation with contracting states and international organizations approved by council for worldwide application pans offer amplify principles in shops contracting states do not have to notify differences from pans in the event of non implementation instrument flight procedure panel instrument flight procedure panel was created in 1971 working groups on pbn new criteria non pbn helicopters maintenance and implementation integration atm procedures quality assurance and crm development members are from australia brazil canada denmark france germany india japan south africa russia uk usa other organization and authorities such as iata eurocontrol fa ifa lpa etc are also part of it. doc 8168 procedures constructions and obstacle clearance criteria for instrument approach procedures were developed by operations division 1949 and issued in 
The division of pants ops into two volumes was done in 1979 after amendment 13 and 14. Doc 8168 pants ops volume 1 flight procedures and volume 2 construction of visual and instrument flight procedures. Both volumes cover operational practices that are beyond the scope of sharps but international uniformity in their application is desirable. DOC 8168 Volume 1 Flight Procedures describes operational procedures recommended for the guidance of flight crew and flight operations personnel. It outlined various parameters on which criteria in Volume 2 are based, thereby emphasizing the need to adhere strictly to the published procedures to maintain safety of operations. DOC 8168 Volume 2 it provides guidance for procedure specialist and describes the essential areas and obstacle clearance requirements for the achievement of safe and regular instrument operations. Talk 8168 Volume 2 is subdivided into four parts. Part 1 is journal, which is uh, further in four sections, terminology, general criteria, departure procedures, and general arrival and approach procedures. Part 2, conventional procedures. It is again further divided into four sections criteria for precision approach, criteria for non precision approach, criteria for in route operations, for VOR and NDV, criteria for holding procedures. Part three it consists of RNAV procedures and satellite based procedures, which are recently done. Part four helicopters. The procedure design in accordance with PANSOFT's criteria assumes normal operations. It is the responsibility of the operator to provide contingency procedures for abnormal operations and emergency operations. Thank you for watching. Keep subscribing us. Thank you.